Hello everyone, there were a lot of comments last time pointing out how bad the tutorial was and I kind of agree, I just threw it together in a hurry, so I'm gonna have to redeem myself with this one. Uh, here's an actual materials list, uh, you'll need all these materials. Uh, plus you also need uh, prismarine crystals um, And maybe some scaffolding Alright, let's get into it Quick side note before we start, I'm actually going to do two different tutorials in this video uh, First we're going to do a block by block tutorial And then I'm going to do a layered tutorial And please tell me in the comments which one you prefer Anyways, let's begin Alright, so once you have your materials We can start with some sandstone slabs A uh, block of coal and stone buttons. Uh, also you might want to grab some tools but I guess if you build this in survival you already have them. Alright so first you want to place down a coal block then go one two three four place another one so four in between and then coal blocks. Then we're gonna go one two three four five six seven eight and then on the ninth block another coal block and then four blocks to your side make sure you're lined up uh, then place buttons of each of the code blocks uh, The code blocks are kind of like wheels Alright, so just bring slabs all the way along from the code blocks Just like this And fill this area in Alright, once you've done that we can go uh, three blocks back one two three and two blocks forward then at the front we want to grab some birch trapdoors and with the birch trapdoors we just want to do like this those are temporary because we want them facing this way all right and then we want to do one two and place two trapdoors just like that so now we've got a base so and something to work with all right now let's work on the front side uh, or not the front one of the sides uh, we want to grab some cut sandstone some smooth sandstone stairs and orange terracotta we also want to grab some normal sandstone all right so in on top of each wheel we want to place a scaffolding in the back and smooth sandstone stairs on top just like that so you get this kind of gap in between then move along with cut sandstone all the way to the next wheel where you want to do the same thing just like that then one more cut sandstone and smooth sandstone stairs there all right now let's move back and bring this one two three four back and a smooth sandstone stair right there then place some trapdoors just like this uh, right here and grab a normal sandstone stair and place it just like that grab a door and place it just like this and then bring orange terracotta just like this all the way to the other side or to the back side and do all the way to the front but not on this block there you want to place a smooth sandstone stair then let's take some sandstone and go two blocks above and two blocks above this side then one two and don't place blocks here because there's going to be a window here later then one two one two one two so three blocks two block gap one block one block then actually a big gap and two blocks there then some slabs three slabs one two three up and the orange terracotta again and the orange terracotta you want to bring uh, one block forward from this uh, sandstone pillar right there then place one sandstone block there 
I grab some walls and we want to grab some glass too. So place a wall there. And then uh, we also want to grab a couple deep slate walls. Place two right there. Then actually two right here with trapdoors underneath. <clears throat> and then we want to move on to the windows. So just place glass panes in these small windows and then uh, black stained glass in the big one so like that all right and also a trap door so the door gets taller now let's do the front window here with one two three glass panes and two sensor walls then another glass pane right there so it should look something like this also while we're doing this we can also place a stair above there we're gonna place the pipe or thing that goes around here and over to the other side and now we're finished with this side uh, let's move on to the other side all right so on this side it looks kind of the same as the other one but not exactly so we want to place from here like two blocks over from the wheel we want to place cut sandstone all the way to the other wheel then place a stair like on the other side two more cut sandstone another stair uh, another cut sandstone and a smooth sandstone that's there at the end then we want to break these two and place cut sandstone slabs there instead never mind uh, actually there's gonna be a sandstone slab there and I cut one here instead so it should like look like this now let's bring three cut sandstones right there a smooth sandstone there and couple deep slate walls like that now they don't connect to this but it's fine we'll fix it later let's actually bring the orange terracotta and bring it all the way from the back here almost all the way to the front then we want to place a stair here just like on that side then we can add some details to this lower part like a ladder here two birch trap doors and actually remove these two place smooth sandstone stairs there too then birch trap doors here and a birch button over this one the oak button right here also we need the uh, uh, oak trapdoors too right there so one two and then a wall right here so it should look like this all right let's head up and right above the ladder here I'm gonna place two walls then grab some normal sandstone slabs place two on either side then go up two blocks with sandstone like this then continue with sandstone over here but leave a gap right there then mirror to that we're gonna place three sandstone slabs and go up one two and place block there actually three so it looks like the L on that side then we're bringing the orange terracotta just like that we can copy this window thing over to this side uh, like this and a sandstone stair right there so it should look like this 
on either side. Then actually what we missed on the other side is uh, the rear mirror, I think it's called. So like that, we want to mirror that to the other side. So just like that, we're missing a detail of cut sandstone slabs. I'm going to bring from this stair over here all the way to the back. All right, once you're done with that, we can go and place some windows. So as earlier in the smaller windows, we're going to place uh, black stained glass. Uh, it's only one small window, so it's only there. Then in the larger ones, we're going to place uh, whole glass blocks. Okay, so now let's add a few more details like a stone button right here and another wall right there. And I think we're finished with this side. Let's move on to the front. Okay, so on the front, we're going to place the four block of codes right here. Then iron bars in front of them. And continue the line of smooth sandstone stairs. And glow item frames as the headlights. Then let's go up. And take black stained glass all the way along this. And glass panes on top. With more uh, glass blocks here. Alright, so sandstone stairs along the top and we're basically done with the front okay so now let's do the back place four sandstone along there then continue the smooth sandstone stair line and place walls like this also walls above here then sandstone and a ladder or it's not actually a ladder, but in the series, there is a ladder here. Actually, let's place sandstone right here too. And one there. Okay, so bring the ladder up. Alright, so let's do the top. Uh, basically, place sandstone uh, like a lid over the whole van. Alright, and also uh, right here we want to dig a hole and right here. So it should look something like this. Alright, so now let's place uh, smooth cords uh, like I do here. And this is to act kind of like uh, air vents, I suppose. And now there's a big hole in the middle and we just want to leave that for now and take end site and place right here just like that all right so then grab uh, the end side slabs and place them on top like that so get these like railing type things so it should look something like this now okay you're now done with the roof let's continue to the inside all right so to save resources we want to build with slabs instead of full blocks so start from the back and go to uh, three blocks like this actually place another one there because we're gonna have water here because uh, so you can brew potions easily so build like this so place one there because we're gonna have a block here and then continue like this and then we want to go down a step, place slabs, uh, four slabs like this. So the stairs are just going to be placed like this. Then some smooth sand, some smooth stone slabs, uh, kind of like the base of the seats. So it should look something like this now. Okay, so now. Uh, the back situation here you can kind of see out and that's not gonna happen later on 
So place sandstone like that. And then five the five smooth sandstone like this. And you're gonna have one left, uh, which we're gonna use later. Then under each of the windows, place a uh, cut sandstone. Uh, place uh, four more sandstone here. Oh wait, I think I calculated wrong. We actually need one more sandstone, so. Okay. Uh, now let's place cut sandstone on the top of the windows as well. And slabs going like this. So it should look something like this. Then we want to move on to this window and place cut sandstone right here and along the top here. So just like that. Okay, now place the last smooth sandstone block right there and the three smooth sandstone stairs there. Then get the oak stairs and place them like this and they are basically the driver seats. Grab some sandstone slabs and basically place them like that. Then some more slabs that goes down like this. Then we want to get the three blue banners and place them like this. And three more sandstone slabs just like that. Okay, now so for the decorations, we can start with some dark oak trapdoors and we can place them one right here. Oh, wait. Uh, one right here, then one here, and one here, then a gap, and one there. Then grab the last two iron bars and place them like that with a brewing stand on top. This brewing stand can have two bottles in it. Doesn't matter which slots, it's just for decoration. That looks good. Alright. And then when I grab a barrel, place it there with a lid. Grab a birch fence right here, then a birch trapdoor, and two more birch trapdoors. Then one item frame, place it down, and grab the prism and crystals and place it because this kind of looks like the blue stuff. Then uh, the th last three bottles. Okay, so over here, we're gonna place one slab, grab two buckets of water, place one right there, and the other one right there, because if you miss and place it right there, the watch is gonna leak out on the outside. So once you've done that, take an armor stand, put it in place, put a helmet on it, perch fence on top, with piston, and a lever. Then move the piston down. Oops. Also, grab a burst trap door, place it like that. So, once it looks like this, you're basically done with this side. Okay, so now you won't leave, need a lever and a piston anymore. Uh, you can just throw away those. Then, Grab chest, place it like this, a barrel at the end, with a lid on top, an oak trapdoor lid. Now we're actually going to start doing the top here, uh, which we're going to need two iron trapdoors, uh, four I mean, placed like this, and the other two we're going to place above here with some smooth quartz stairs above. We want to place down two chiseled polished blackstone with slabs as lids. Then I came up with this flag. You can see how I did it. And I place those there. They kind of look like the logo on the barrels. And also I uh, place a barrel, a uh, cauldron right there. Okay, so let's continue with this part up here. Go up top here and then uh, place down uh, the glazed terracotta like this and then birch slab 
like that okay so then place two more birch slabs and i think we don't won't need these place a blue concrete powder right there okay so we're almost done now we're just gonna build a smoke and this is quite a tricky part okay so first you might want to enchant your things with silk touch so if you do something wrong you can break them and get them back okay so now let's continue with the glass which you want to place just like this uh, this part is actually i think it's easier to do in layers so this is gonna be layer one then we want to place uh, glass panes just like this and actually we want one right here right there it can be tricky sometimes to place the scaffolding here but you get it okay so now let's grab two more uh, glass blocks just like this then panes around like that and another one out so this looks like a chair then go over to this place like this uh, i don't really know what that's that looks like but you get it okay also we want to place one right here so it looks kind of like a bacteria or something okay so then want to place like this and uh, like a l and one more right here and one here and there then go back one two and place one two just like that okay now let's place uh, one to start by placing one there then one out then go up top and one two like a lightning strike then go one uh, slab then one glass pane and remove the slab so like that actually i forgot to add uh, one two two glass panes right here i also forgot to add go one out here then add two more like this okay so now let's start by placing uh one stained glass right there one right there a slab in the middle here and one right there oops actually this one i think it's moved too far to the left so let's move it one block to the right it doesn't matter that much if you get it wrong it's uh, basically just smoke okay so one two right here then go out one and place an l right here just like that okay what you might want to do is play some scaffolding so you can easily climb and if you fall down you won't be hurt as much so place one glass block right here then another one there then a glass plane pane in between and stick it out like so it looks kind of like a T then uh, at the end here I want to place another one another glass pane and then on this side we're gonna we want to go one two then a full block and a pane right here we want to place two slabs so we can get on top place a pane right there so it looks like that okay now let's place one and two all right so we got two glass paints over and one blue stained glass and i actually i th don't think we really need them i could maybe try and place the stained glass right there and a paint there and on top and boom i think we're done
thank you so much for watching if this tutorial helped make sure to like and subscribe also if you're having trouble with the build i'm going to leave a download link in the description see ya